Hi all, it's David here from DP Computing. Today we've got a Toshiba Tecra R950. Just going to have, show you how to replace the battery, hard drive and memory of this unit. Uh, before we proceed, just a word of warning, proceed at your own risk. If something you see here doesn't match what you're seeing, please stop and seek professional help because sometimes the same model can be slightly different. This one you probably can't see. As I said, it's a Tecra R950 Toshiba and the part number is PT535A-05E023. Now the first thing we have to do, or well, please take, take, take static precautions if I haven't said that already. Now the first thing we have to do is remove it from the power and the power adapter on this one. There are you. Oh, it's just at the back, up here at the back. Okay, so make sure you pull it out from the power and remove the battery, which is just sitting here. For the battery, there's two little clips. Just push them outwards. Should be able to then slide out the battery. So there's the battery. The part number of the battery, or the model number of this one, is PA3905U-1BRS. And it's 11.1 11 volt, 11 .1 volt 5700 milliamps. So if you need to replace it, there's the details. Now we've got three main panels here. The little bit here, here, if you're wondering, is for a docking station. So there's one, two, three screws to remove. Now this one should be for the Wi Fi card. Sometimes if you can't get under, just use a little can't get your fingernails under just use a little thing and there we can see the actual Wi-Fi card it's just hidden under there it's held in by two more screws now under here will be the memory again my nails aren't long enough so just pop that up and you see there's two slots for the memory it's got one slot free and once one's been used take that one out there's two little silver clips, push them outwards and the memory will pop up which we can then pull out. Now to put new memory in, just make sure it's in the right, right way because there's a little slot there, or a little empty sort of gap which matches up to the socket. So just push that in and then push it down until the silver things clip in. The hard drive, it's over here. Again, there's one more screw. Once that's undone, you can remove the little cover and there, there's the hard drive there. Now to get it out is we need to push it that way and then you can pull it up. And there we are. It's in a little mounting bracket, which another four screws there. So take those four screws out and it'll come out of that mounting bracket. Um, one other thing is the optical drive, which is on the side here. That'll be held in, I believe, by this screw. So there's two actual screws there. One you'll see is, is a deeper one and there's a little KB mark next to it which will be for the keyboard. So we don't need that one, it's the, the one next to it. So undo that screw. And there you see the optical drive comes out. So there's the optical drive. The part number on the optical drive is model number UJ8C2. So if that needs to be replaced, there's the details for you, if you can see that. Well, thank you for watching and check out um, our YouTube channel for other openings of other Toshiba and various other, I suppose, laptop models. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you next time. Bye for now.